Hello, welcome to day 10 of our 30 days hair growth challenge. I'm so amazed we've already reached 10 days. If you're joining us for the first time, the challenge is very easy. Uh, it's rose, mary and cloves water that you apply to your hair twice per day. So we've been doing this and this is already day 10. I have mine in my spray bottle and I spray it like this. I spray it like this. In the morning and in the evening i do this twice per day and when i'm done spraying i massage it just like this into my scalp yes just like this and i do this for it to also hydrate my hair strands so um, if you're joining us for the first time it is nice you came on the right day because um, my rosemary is true, but it's not transparent, so you cannot see it. But my rosemary and cloves water is almost finished. So I'm going to do a new stuff today. It's true that there are previous videos on my YouTube channel, and you can see the whole recipe on my YouTube channel. But today, I'm going to do another stock for the rest of the week because this it made something like 10 days, 500 milliliters. So I'm doing another stock for the next 10 days probably. So let's do it together. So the very first thing that you need is this rosemary leaves. I'm going to blend it all into powder. So I will put it in the container of my blender. I will put five teaspoons. After putting the rosemary leaves, I'm going to add cloves. I'll put four teaspoons. So this, these are the cloves. And now I'm going to blend this. I just close it like this and I will blend it. So that many people in their videos do not blend the rosemary leaves and cloves. But I'm a pharmacist and in school we learned that when you grind your plant extract into powder, the solvent that you apply, in this case it's water, will extract more of the active ingredient because there's a larger surface area. So that's why I grind, I blend my own. Other people do not do that, but if you want to maximize your active ingredients, you should do this. So this is it, I hope you can see. Now I put it in this, it's just an old mayonnaise container that I cleaned. It's approximately a 500 milliliters container and I will, I will add my hot water to this. Um, this is glass so it's going to be really hot. So the hot water is in the kettle, it's very very hot. I'm just going to add it. Okay, after adding the water, this is the result. So it is like tea, if you smell it, it smells amazing. Honestly, the smell is so refreshing, you will love it. So when I have this like this, I just let it it's hot, so I let it cool down for hours, and then I keep it in the fridge. Afterwards, I filter it. So I'll keep it in the fridge. Afterwards, I filter it with this. And if, like really, if there are too many small particles that will also cross this, I use a filter paper, okay? So after that, I can now put it in my spray bottle. So this is basically all. It's very easy to do. So when you do this and you have your tea, you spray it on your hair in the morning and in the evening and it's going to make your hair grow longer and stronger. So if you like this recipe, please leave a like, of course. If you like this type of recipes, natural hair recipes, please check out my book. 
Um, Start Your Natural Hair Journey from Scratch. It is a book with natural hair recipes. It's going to help you to take care of your natural hair in a natural way. There are natural recipes in there and there are also tips on transitioning from relaxed to natural hair if your hair is relaxed and you're trying to transition. Grab a copy of the book. Also, um, if you like this challenge or if you're planning to join us for this challenge, write in the comment section, I'm joining you for the challenge. If you've already joined the challenge and you're facing difficulties, please write in the comment section so that I can know how to help you. Either I will reply directly with a comment or I can even reply with a video depending on your needs. And also, if you have not yet joined the challenge but you have so many questions and you want to know where to start from, and after watching the videos, you still do not know like how to go about it, please leave a comment and I will reply to answer all your questions. And finally, if you enjoy my content, please support my channel by subscribing. And finally, please share this video with other people who need to grow your hair or who want to grow your hair so that they can join us in this challenge and see how your hair will grow amazingly fast. So thank you so much for watching. God bless you and bye-bye.